Hey, I'm back. It's the mortgage doctor, Terry Williams. If you're thinking about refinancing or purchasing a home right now, call me. I can help. All right, let's talk about today's topic. Have you heard the news? The HARP loan. Have you heard of that? The Home Affordable Refinance Program called HARP. It's a program put in place by the government, Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac, those two pseudo-government institutions that you hear about in the news all the time. They put this program in place to help homeowners that are underwater. Well, previously the program had guidelines that set loan to value at 125% loan to value. What you owed could be no more than 125% of the home's value i.e. you couldn't owe more than $125,000 on a $100,000 house and you had to have certain credit scores and certain requirements to qualify. Well guess what? That program only helped about 800 and some thousand people in since its existence put in place. The government has redid that program, reduced the guidelines so that more people can qualify so we can keep people in their houses. How does that sound? That's a great idea, huh? Let's keep people in their houses. So the new HARP loan, again, HARP stands for Home Affordable Refinance Program, brings into play no loan to value restrictions anymore, no credit score guidelines, no warrants or representations from the lenders to Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. That's a big thing. The lenders do not have the same requirements to underwrite the loan. All right, to qualify for a HARP loan, you have to have uh, originated your first mortgage before March, uh, or I'm sorry, April of 2009. So April of 2009, how many people qualify for that? A lot. Second thing is you can't have any existing new debt, i.e. mortgages, second mortgages on your property. Wow, that's exciting. All right, there's a lot of details involved. The article below will talk about some of the things. If you have questions, call the mortgage doctor for additional details. I'll see you on the other side.